lung cancer. Action kind of boring called the hack on liver and frack. It comes to go. Now, frack is the first of February 2000. When it comes to the so, you think polio has been eradicated? Well, you may be surprised to find out. Far from it. In fact, there's now a new cog in the machine, so to say. What we have is this. An article titled, Polio Mutated Virus Breaches Vaccine Protection. This article was published and presented through the Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences by researchers from the University of Bonn this August 2014. This is what happened, and this adds a twist to the story. When they went to the Congo in 2010, there were 445 people fully confirmed infected with the polio virus. Of that 445, 209 of those individuals died in 2010 of the polio virus. Now here is where the twist of the story becomes quite intriguing. Of that 445, half of them received three vaccine doses of the polio virus, meaning they were fully vaccinated. And that's where the University of Bonn started getting involved in researching what is going on. And this is what they discovered. The new polio virus that has presented itself in the Congo, in their words, the pathogen has mutated at a decisive point, meaning that the current vaccine is not going to offer much strength against the new form of polio. And here is what they found out. They took the pol new polio virus back from the Congo, and they took blood samples from 34 medical students, and they tested the new polio virus against fully vaccinated individuals, or I should say the blood, not the individuals themselves. They came to the conclusion, one in five would have probably most definitely been infected. A really up to more like one in three probably would have actually been infected if it was actually live polio virus from the Congo by the new virus. And there is where the conclusion comes from the University of Bonn. And I'll post a citation that in the, in the video or at the bottom. The researcher said, quote, this is without ad-libbing, the result, the antibodies induced by the vaccine can hardly block the mutated virus and render it harmless, meaning the current vaccine offers virtually very little protection. And even worse, as far as a hypothetical scenario, it is possible you could have what's called wild excretors. Wild excretors are individuals, and you can look this up, obviously, that have been vaccinated with the polio virus, but the polio virus never died, and they don't catch polio. So effectively, they're carriers, meaning you can have a wild excretor with this new pathogen create havoc in the entire area. So what am I saying? Keep an eye out. This is not being pro-vaccine, anti-vaccine. This is about addressing a critical issue that has occurred, whether you come out with an effective vaccine, effective medication, effective treatment, you do something. Because if you do nothing, this could get really scary really fast. Again, Ralph, signing out, and thank you very much for listening once again.